Hey guys, welcome to my channel. Today and welcome to my channel, no, Ladles my and Lily. Hey. Welcome to my channel, Ladles and Lily. <laughs> I'm Caleb, and this is my special guest, Francis. <laughs> and today we're going to do some unboxings. We're going to do it about, there's history unboxed. Um, it's an unboxing thing for uh, kids of all ages from five to young adult. Yes, the five to young adult, and today we have Benin inside the box. <laughs> There's an informational book on Benin, and let's see what's inside. You get some further reading. This is not funny at all. Oh, he said the comic is not funny. I don't think it's meant to be funny. I think it's meant to be educational. Um, there's all different types of stuff inside for you to talk about. Benin, you get a cool book on, it says, Visiting Ooh, Africa yes. on your eight-note kalimba. And that's what um, Caleb actually has in his hand. You want to open it? Yep. It's a cedar board thumb piano. This looks cool. So, it. let's see. This is actually really cool. Let's see, Caleb. Can we play one of these? This old man. Look. 535, 535. Oh, that's cool. Okay. They're going to have definitely have fun with this. That's cool. And he Okay. Is he leaving? He's leaving. I'll walk through the rest of the box with you because my son has saw the kalimba and now he's going to go play. Um, this book also has about the kalimba and how to play. And this is nice. I really like this. Um, the book that has uh, more informational reading for you to read inside. Sorry, I'm dropping stuff. It also comes with a letter. That's cool. It says 1440 AD. You get a coloring sheet. It says in the streets of Benin, a little comic. These are um, Nigerian bar soaps. Oh, they smell good too. Are you guys gonna bathe with Wait, these? Bars of soap? I thought those were like magnets or something. No, they bars of soap. Are you gonna try one? Ooh. We'll have to let you know how we like the soap later. They smell good. <laughs> it does smell very good. So we have two of those. So next we have snail shells. These guys, are what they really use. fun. I, I'm addicted to this now. These are what they what they use for currency. So they get to make a bracelet out of these and we have two of them so they can two of them can make the bracelets it's actually very nice um this old man that's fun we <laughs> So guys, if you would like to check out History Unbox, there is a link below that you can click on to check them out. Um, as far as price goes, they have mini boxes, they have big boxes, so their prices range um, from about, I would say, 35 all the way up to 75 So um, if you think your child will like this, this is a great way to put some hands on into your history homeschool curriculum. So we use our other bar of soap and everybody in the house has liked the soap so far. Um, me and having eczema, this bar of soap was good. And I've had no, my skin has had no reactions to it. So I do like the soap. visiting the most beautiful city. Benin City is surrounded by a forest. Huge walls made of mud surround the city for protection. I haven't seen anything like it since we visited the Great Wall of China. Once we were in the gates, crowds filled the street. Their clothes were blue, yellow, green, and white. The richer looking people wore strands of red coral. I love seeing all the colors. Next we have, these are called snail. It's like a tongue twister. <clears throat> Caleb, put the dog down. Hey guys, welcome, it's Caleb. 
to my what? channel. Kayla, put them down, please, so we can get it done. Okay, bye, Mochi. Benin City is surrounded by a fort, by a fort.